Chances are when you upload your reels to Instagram, they just look like absolute dog shit. Now, I was in the same boat and it was super frustrating considering I literally bought like a $3,000 camera. I got a nice lens. I did a nice color grade. I spent all that time and effort just for it to look like an Android. And I hate Androids, you know? Androids are trash. Actually, they're not trash. They're just... Actually, the cameras are probably pretty good now. I actually can't even say that anymore. It's just a meme. It really is just a meme. So what I'm getting at is I'm going to share with you guys the best render settings for Instagram and TikTok in 2025. It's crazy that it's already 2025, but here we are. All right, so first things first, you have your video completed. You want to go ahead and hit I and then O for like the in and out point of your reel. And then you want to go over here to the export tab. So change the file name to like reel, whatever it is. This is where you like save it to location. Uh, I like to just save it to actually my desktop. And then I kind of just delete it uh, once it's in my phone. Because once it's in my phone, we're good to go. Hit save. And then preset. Let's actually go ahead and create our own after. But format H.264 is what I like. Go to video. Go to more render maximum depth use maximum render quality now if i'm gonna be honest it just sounds like a very fancy thing so i just click it and i've seen a lot of people do it so that's just what i do it's the best practice go down below to bitrate encoding vbr two pass and then i honestly just like to throw it to um halfway now there is really no reason as to why you could go three quarters. I've even seen people do like literally a quarter. So my personal preference is like halfway, but a little bit above halfway. So like 33 ish. And then the actual secret sauce, which it's not secret. If you guys have noticed when you render out your video, it loses that saturation and loses kind of like that polished look that you have in Premiere Pro. It just doesn't look the same on your phone. The way you fix that is by going into effects, Lumetri look glut, applied custom. And then if you guys go down below or cop my free editing pack on my website, um, it's gonna have this in the download folder for you guys. So I'm gonna go to downloads and just type in QT Gamma. And then this is actually a LUT that I got from someone else. Uh, shout out to that homie. I honestly forgot his name, but made a good LUT or he just shared a good LUT. And then what you guys will see here is that it looks different. It looks a lot more like uh, contrasty, which it needs to because kind of like it, Premiere will desaturate it after the render. So it's kind of just compensating for that. That's why it's a called a compensation LUT. So hope that helps. But that's really the secret sauce to actually like getting your colors looking amazing. And then after that, all that's left to do is one, you could export it or you could go over here to save presets. And then just do like, just save it to whatever you want. I'm actually gonna save it because I've never saved this preset before. I don't know why. Chris IG render settings 2025. Hit okay, that's a preset, it's saved. And then you just go ahead and hit export and it's gonna export for you. All right, so now that your video is exported, it'll kind of tell you that it's been done. But anyways, guys, that is the end of the video. If you guys like this video, please like, comment, subscribe down below. And again, I just wanna express that I am so grateful for each and every single one of you that watch these videos. If you guys have any feedback, if you guys have any ideas for products, that would actually help you in your workflow, please let me know. As I'm genuinely just trying to build the best editing preset store for creators just like you, like literally you. And if you guys wanna see how I use my presets to edit YouTube videos, go ahead, check out the video on screen right now. Remember, take action, take over. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.